Never mind, false alarm. We're good. Sorry, I thought I heard a Pepsi open, but it was just background noise. All right. Um. Well, everybody. Yeah, I think so. Alright guys, Mook is our point man, he's the guy with the tallest backpack of red, right here next to the red and white house. He's going to be getting a bearing with a compass. Uh, if you guys are interested in learning how to use a compass, let me know, I have an extra one that you can borrow or hold on to. Uh, they're not that great, generally it's better to like find your own point on the map, but if you do want to know, they do come in handy, they are helpful. So if you're interested in a compass, let me know. No, I don't give a shit, I don't use it here, right here on the road. Uh, you guys just... Alright. So it's right there. Uh, hang on, give me give me just a minute. I'm going to show how to use a compass just because he asked, and then we'll go. So right off the bat, it'll be in your hotbar. Um, fucking pick it up, or pull it out, and then hit spacebar, and then you should be able to aim it like that. Alright, and then that's it. That'll tell you where you're facing. So when you're done... Yeah, buddy. So let's rock and roll catch up to the rest of the group. Alright, so I'm going to hold the uh, the rear, no pun intended. You guys all stick together, stay behind Mook. Make sure you hit spacebar, or hit the button with your compass to put it away so you can move faster again. Uh, no, you still got it equipped, like it's still in your hands. So if it's like 3 on your hotbar, push 3. There you go. And then it... Yeah, buddy, you guys are all making great progress. And again, we have the, a serious luxury in the fact that no one has fucking killed and raped us to death yet. Or raped us to death. Again, low pop server for the education. And plus now I got a kind of handy, lame tutorial video I can put on YouTube. By the way, I've recorded all of this, so... Yeah. Uh, there's like a zombie at our rear. But just keep moving, we should be fine. Actually, looks like two zombies at our rear. Alright, I'm going to be firing, so don't freak out. Yeah, we're good. Keep moving. No, no. I can see both of you. And Bruce, oh yeah, you may want to hold up. I think you've lost our team. I've got... Uh, I've got Dan... And Zug Zug in sight. Oh no, sorry, I've got Zug Zug and Matt in sight. Matt, your compass is out again, buddy. I wish I hadn't given you that compass. Double tap W and you can sprint. And it'll make you. It'll start motoring, yeah. Double tap W. Double tap W. Alright, we're coming up the hill, buddy. No, it's... Yeah, hang on. Yeah, so you guys stop up ahead. I'm, right, so I'm following suit. You may have to check your bindings. But yeah, you're... Because you'll start really fucking motoring if you sprint. Right now you're just running. You're not sprinting. I don't know how to trigger your sprint, though. It might be an option. Then again, when you're going uphill, it won't work either. Uh, I definitely don't have sight on you guys. I had eyes on either Zug Zug or Dan, but I don't know since I'm with Matt, though. I am using my in-game voice, so you can hear me using it. Does anybody hear me? There we go. Hang on, I got... Uh, Alright. I think... Zug Zug? That's, is that you? Okay, perfect. So Zug Zug has got the motorcycle jacket. Right, good. All right, perfect. So stick close to Zug Zug there, man. I'll hold up the rear. Wait, 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 wait. Hang on, hang on. Zug Zug, stop. Zug Zug, stop. We lost Matt. I see. Okay, I found the rest of the group. We, we, you got Matt. Okay. All right. All right. You're going back for him. Man, he's over here. Okay, everyone go to everyone go to Bruso. Matt, stop. I can see you, buddy. To your right. To your right. Look. Okay, cool. We're going to link up. I want to make sure you can sprint, because that's the reason you're getting left behind. 
So everyone go stand by Mook and put your eyes on me for a second. Yeah, I know. I can't. Um, yeah, take it out. I can't beat it to death with a fishing rod. Just, yeah, one. Don't, yeah, don't axe at the same time. I'll bandage him if he needs it. Let him take it. Are you in first person or are you in third person? There, there you go. You're good. You're good. You're good. Alright, he's bleeding. I'm going to bandage him. Just stay, stay put. Stay put. I got him. Okay. Um, Alright, so everyone's eyes on me. So, walking, everyone pretty much understands. This is walking. Running, pretty standard. You can see my arms are moving kind of slow. It's kind of like a fast jog, right? This is generally how you get it on the terrain. However, the fastest way to move, which is the way we should be moving all the time, is sprinting. So, it'll, you'll notice your arms go way faster. You'll cover a lot of ground. Now, by default, sprinting is usually double tapping W. However, you may have to bind it. So, I'm going to check that right now to let you know how to do that. Here we go. Fast forward. If you, so if you hit escape, go to controls, go to assignments, and look for fast forward. And it says 2XW. Okay. So you can set that to... I think if you double click that, you can change it to... Like you can hit W twice for it. I don't know for sure how to bind it, but you're going to want to bind that to something so you can sprint. Alright. 2 times W is the best way to do it because... So you're going to go hit escape, configure, controls, assignments. Yeah, boys. That's how you do it. Guys, how did... Yeah, when you when you select it so that it's cleared, it's past bind. There you go, yeah. Alright. So everyone get behind Mook and stay on Mook 6. I'll hold the rear and keep eyes behind us. And we are good to proceed whenever you're ready there, Mook. So again, you'll notice you'll lose speed drastically. You'll lose speed drastically when you go uphill. The way to around that is serpentining or moving. Basically, the, the simplistic explanation is that at a 45 degree incline, you will lose top speed. But at like a 40 degree incline, you will maintain it. So if you zigzag the right way, you can continue sprinting without losing pace. You'll see King Mook demonstrating. I've got a zombie behind me. I'm going to take it out. I'm not going to take it out. Keep moving. Just keep moving. The zigzagging is a perfect way to both ditch the zombie and make sure you don't get hit. Bear in mind, if you see a flash of black and white, it means the zombie is trying to eat you. Just keep trying to maintain your sprint speed while you get up the hill. When we get into this castle, someone's going to have to kill the zombie. But yeah, get up to it. Get into that castle, boys. That's okay. These guys need to practice. Honestly, zombies can be as hard to kill as players with axes. Nice. You guys are showing a natural tenacity for murdering zombies. Yeah, I will give you the, like, oh, server's down. Okay, so in this situation, guys, this, actually, we've had a lot of, we've had a really fortunate run, but I'm going to explain something really quickly. So when you see no message received, it means the server is generally not necessarily crashed, but restarted. Presently, they're working on populating the game with items that last when you log out and when you log in that last consistently on the server, but right now, because that's not been optimized, what will happen is most servers reset after a couple hours. Right off the bat, you just hit escape, go to exit, confirm the changes, and then at your next screen, usually you can just hit play and it'll load you back into that server. If that doesn't work, it's because the server hasn't started back up yet. In this case, we're all going to exit, give it a few minutes, and then Mook and I are going to try and log into that server, and then once we're in, you can join off of him and I, or just hit play if it's up and running. So everyone should be back in the main menu screen, give or take. Alright, never mind, then we're just going to join off of Mook in the friends list.